Oh hi, it's El Pie Man once again. Welcome you back to Super Pony All Stars: Friendship is Magic. We finally got the last game of this collection, great collection. And we are doing Super Pony Three, or is known as Super Alicorn Sisters. And Mr. Ben is back with the desert. Well, hello everyone. As the curtain rises on another pony game. Super Alicorn Sisters, and uh, for the hacker who made this game, um, this is the most uh, work, worked on game of the four. Put more work into this than the others. That seems pretty obvious right from the start. Absolutely. So let's see Aluna fight against each other. Yeah. <laughs> Well, in one player you play is only Celestia's, but since I have a controller here, I play two players. We're gonna play as Celestia and Luna together. They will co-op. Co-op player beating the levels. Tia, start. I see. Uh, unlike the uh, previous games, we actually see that there, in the bottom left, the Mario thing has been replaced with a C for Celestia. For once. The bipedal stances still look kind of odd. Oh, just their walking stance? Yeah. Alright. And a raccoon tail and raccoon ears. Yeah. Although it seemed like she was able to fly by her using her wings. Yeah, you, yeah. yeah the wings are really uh, moving. Which is a nice touch. Yeah. Let's just pretend that she's flying by with her wings, not with her tail. Yeah. I was about to say, because it kind of makes me wonder why she even still needs to have the raccoon tail to even be able to fly if she still has her wings in uh, super form. It's the power of the raccoon she needs. She secretly needs it. Now we have Luna. Luna, start. Oh, Luna looks cute, though. I saw, uh, like, right there before she was, uh on the the world map it just seemed like i i saw that there was definitely a the luna was replaced with luigi or something like that <laughs> so i take it you can still uh activate the battle thing with uh, the two player as well on this one as well absolutely yes <laughs> steal just... cards from yourself and get extra one ups All right I never, I've never seen it played. I, mean, I never, I've never tried it for myself. Oh, geez. That could have been ugly. Okay. Going right there in, in the bottomless pit, like right there on <sighs> level two. That would be a typical style death for me. Yeah. But now that you mention it, I wonder, I wonder what happens if you do uh, try to uh, battle. Yeah, I see. I've definitely seen Mario like. Hmm. Oh, that doesn't no, seem to I let you. No, because because I'm using one controller, there is no point. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. That makes, that's, yeah. Pre that's prevented me from doing that. Well, that's kind of a shame. It does kind oh. of make sense, but it's like, why, why do you... It makes sense, yeah. Yay. Go to the skies. Clouds look like butts to me. <laughs> Endless sea of butts. Is this what heaven looks like? I have no idea. Oh, I completely forgot that was even up there, that uh, that one up. Hmm. No, I can easily just get the... Um, the the, the warp whistle, yeah. Yeah, but there's no point. No point in doing that. Going through this game normally, because again everything has changed in this game. I want to showcase all that. Just making up this mushroom house. Hey, Cadence. <laughs> its contents will help you on your way. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, a little bit of an interesting little trivia fact here. Um, every time you go into a toad house, 
the what you call the the power up that you would have gotten is already predetermined, regardless of uh, which chest you choose. Oh, seriously? You, yeah, you can actually test this out for yourself if you do like a a save state, and um, you uh, select the chest. If you reload the state and you select another chest, it doesn't matter which chest you choose. Your the uh, power up's always going to be the same. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even know that. Yeah, I used to always like try to go for the middle because I always thought that that had the best item. But then I realized that no, it. Or when I found out that you that, that it doesn't matter, I just decided you know I'm just gonna pick the first one that I come across because it, it it doesn't matter. <laughs> so <laughs> predetermined. Well, that's not fair. Yeah. It is kind of a dick move. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Oh, screwed it up for you, Luna. Sorry. Say, <laughs> so, yeah, if I'm not mistaken, I know that if you hit that at a dead run, it, like, almost always is star. a, uh, yeah, star. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> and and Caden's small. Also... <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I know she was smaller than, than Princess Celestia is, but I didn't think she was that small. Yeah. <laughs> Fail. He's so oh, tiny. Wow. <laughs> He's a itty little bitty teeny tiny little one. I am pink. This is my fire fire flower form. Pink Lestia, oh no. Pink Lestia, oh god, it's the uh... It's Let's fly to the castle. It's the bad, it's the bad form of Celestia. Pink Celestia. Oh, nice run there. I don't think I would have ever made that. Right. Ah. Boom, boom. Oh, shit. Fucking crushed him. Uh. Very nicely done. Thank you. Let's see. Yep, that's it. Alright, Logie. Go get your special uh, P-Wing. Hello, you found my shop of strange and wonderful things. Hmm. Huh. Not much of a shop if I'm not buying anything. Right. <laughs> Slide down. So how did you even get that, that P thing to even uh, show up? Or was it that you just, uh... You uh, killed Boom Boom with, like, an, enough time on the... I know there's, like, a way you can, like, get white uh, ships to appear if you're... Uh, okay. your, your coins and your score or in yeah. a certain digit yeah yeah uh the the white mushroom houses are the uh if you collect a certain amount of coins in a certain level yeah yeah it's, it will appear I, I, but it's random levels i'm just trying to run i'm i don't remember the exact uh areas and i don't remember the exact amount of coins you need but i do know that you can get white mushroom houses to show up on, I think, like even travel level or even numbered levels. Right. So. Mm. I have one of each. One up. Mm. Now, if I'm, now if I'm not mistaken, if you get a game over with one character, and you decide to continue, uh, all the courses that that particular character is cleared has uh, becomes uncleared, right? Yes. Okay, I thought I thought as much. So, and if you like, say, move on with one character, and you still haven't cleared it with the other, then um, that one character has to clear the clear the world first before they can move on, right? Right. I didn't even know you could even do that with the <laughs> with the raccoon power. I never even tried that. <laughs> it's a little trick. I didn't know about it until later. Man, I'm... <laughs> that's kind of embarrassing. I'm like 30 years old and I've never known that. To be... I, I, I've played this game ever since it came out when I was a kid. Mario, start. <laughs> Alright. 
Okay, Cadence. And now we, the ch now we get to raid the now we get to raid the chest of Celestia. <laughs> raid her chest? Instead? <laughs> oh, it's terrible. The king has been transformed. Please find the magic wand so we can change him back. Cadence is Man, Cadence is just just everywhere. <laughs> Cadence is toad in this game, apparently. So does that mean there's like like fifty of her running around? <sighs> Pretty much. <laughs> this is something about the cloning machine. I was about to say, wait, I got it. It's not Cadence. It's just a bunch of changelings who's just like disguises her. <laughs> Doctor Who. Crystalis must... is behind the whole thing. <laughs> Doctor Who's must have done something. Yeah. It's a multiply. I'm not getting that. I'm not being pink. Screw that. Yeah. I don't know if you can actually uh, kill the Koopalings like you could with with regular Bowser in Super Mario One. I don't know if you could do that with the the Fire Flower here in Super Mario. 3. You might be able to, but I've never tried that. All right, down we go. It's a changeling. Shit, I was just kidding about Crystal Spin behind the whole thing. Huh. Uh, get that. Fall. Fall like it's nothing. Huh. Hey, and man. then Celeste just hey, lasted man, the whole man. thing. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> so Mare Mare is the queen of uh, grassland. I wonder if uh, these are all changed over as well. So Princess Twilight is Princess Peach Toadstool in this one here. Yep, that's for it. Then that's our quest. Yep. And if you, if you see any ghosts, be careful. <laughs> they will give chase if you turn away. <laughs> I've enclosed a duel that helps protect you, Princess Toadstool. Even though it's not Princess Toadstool, that's obviously Princess uh, Twilight. Princess What's Her Face. Yeah, <laughs> Princess <laughs> What's Her Face. I like I like that one better. <laughs> I can't believe I couldn't even remember her name. That's that. That's freaking embarrassing. Says what's her name? <laughs> that's 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 <laughs> Earthworm Jim already. <laughs> Princess, I don't give a damn. <laughs> Princess, what's her name? <laughs> All right, mushroom. Damn it. Oh. Well, at least you can still get a a, a one up with that. I think. Oh, Luna. Luna's on top of the car. Well, here's a bit of a, a, a trick with the, the cards here. Um, the end spade cards. So, on the bottom bottom row there, uh, the leftmost one will always... The leftmost... The, the three leftmost ones on the bottom row will always remain the same, no matter uh, what puzzle it is. I don't remember exactly which one it is in order. I think the left one is always a star... The middle one's always... No. Okay, so the left one's always a mushroom. I believe the middle one's always a flyer flower, and then the third one is always a star. Um, and even if you fail for whatever reason, uh, even if uh, it messes up on this one, uh, it will always be the same uh, layout. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, let's try our luck on this. I used to be able to get these uh, line up, uh, line them up, uh, the these up. Uh, one of the, one of each. Damn it! I used to be able to do that one really well, but ever since, like, I was a kid, I just haven't been able to get it. Also, hate it when I'm like trying to say something and I'm just tripping over my own tongue, <laughs> like I just was. Or John does the same thing, and I jump on him. I'm like, shut up. Like, how rude. Oh, one up. Hey. How you doing? Get on there. Thank you. Get all these coins. 
I was say, yeah, I think this is the one where you have to like get like every last coin available, well, so you can even get the uh, what you call the the white mushroom house to appear. Yep. Should appear right now. There it is. That's a little nice. It's a little spread the taking. Do not touch Celestia. Okay. That's like a fortress. I always love the fortress theme on here. Right. And it just got even better with the the SNES remake. <laughs> You know, I didn't even know you could fly over these two. That that's awesome. <laughs> but don't fly too high. Can't can't uh don't fly too high though. Yeah, there's, then it'll. Uh... There's, a, there's invisible spikes up there. Oh, that, that's not fun. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like I guess the creators are smart just to put it up there, and the gamers would try to cheat their way in. Alright, let's get my anchor. anchor. Looks like Luna's got a good deal of swag over here. <laughs> it's got a way anchor. Okay. Now fly. Fly, butter, fly, fly. Is... It's a cavalcade of coins. There's a one up here. Damn. <laughs> oh. Hit by an enemy. Ouch. <laughs> Get all that money. That's it. Getting. Getting that paper, <laughs> even though it's not actually paper. The paper is just coins. Some yeah. can't get that metal. Oh wait, they're not. Yeah. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Maybe they're brass. I don't know. Are they made of copper? Who knows? <laughs> Who gives a shit? Just golden coins made out of gold. I'm just number three. Another fucking mushroom. Great. And getting nothing but mushrooms. And we have well, on the flip side, at least you, there's a good way to get high. <laughs> right. Get high in mushrooms. Now we have the sun of sadness. <laughs> no, no, that stupid sun. <laughs> oh, so angry. That always made me laugh, Judd. Oh. Well, not really. Oh, got done in by the uh, by the sand trap. Is is and Celeste being killed by her own thing that she raises up and high every morning. <laughs> you're a sun god like, and you're getting killed by your own uh, your own power. All right, boomerang brother. The sun apparently is just tired of uh, having it. Celeste you just raise it up and down every morning. <sighs> And that's the music box. <laughs> another mushroom? Let's see. How about door? Yeah, I'm... How about block number two? It's another mushroom! It's a leaf for once. Yay! It's actually not a mushroom. That's great. So. <laughs> uh, a little plus here for a second. Right. Okay. Okay, let's... Get Four... Four. Four. Oh. <laughs> <It's> golf. <laughs> oh, too bad I can't take the shortcut. Yeah. <laughs> oh. No leaf power for you. Unless. Let me see. Let's take no. I want a shell. Give me a shell. There we go. There's my. Now I can take the shortcut. Yeah.
You know, considering the fact that she's just ramming that thing with her head, she's gonna have like one hell of a migraine when she wakes up in the morning. Like, uh... <laughs> uh, Luna, dear sister, don't let me have the absen absentee again. Again. <laughs> don't make me put you in the booty. I'm not even sad! <laughs> it's that one flash I remember a long time. <laughs> I just cried on the moon. <laughs> I, mean, I, I don't think I remember that one. <laughs> same, same person that made the your mother go bananas on the moon. Oh yeah, that one, yeah. I was just crying in the moon. I'm not even sad! <laughs> I love that one. Oh, damn it. Fine. Fine, Boomerang Brother. I'll shut up. <sighs> another card. Great. Well, at least you get another chance at your, uh, the end spade. Luna's gotta take that. Luna's so depressed being small. Another mushroom. Great. Damn it. Uh, wait, there was a flop. Oh no, uh. No. Damn it. Dang. I know where the one ups are now. They're probably. They're right next to each other. Oh, why would you go there? Right next to the chain. See? That's what happens! Oh. Dick. I know there's a little bit of a fun fact on the uh, the chain chomp here. I don't remember exactly uh, how many times it it takes for them to do it. I think it's like 42 times, but uh, if the, eventually if uh, if <laughs> eventually that that chain chomp chain is going to uh, to shatter. <laughs> And it'll actually be free to bounce around after you. It's like, oh my god, no! Okay. And my coins. Ah. Uh, screw that one coin. Screw that coin. Right. Screw that coin in particular. See yeah, if you can get yeah, all. Five. Yeah, five up. Woo! Yes. You got a card. <laughs> you got a card. 